tattoo time. Yes, Hi, is. how are you? Doing? How you doing? I'm good. How y'all doing? Good. How are you with your, your stilettos, child? I'm, I'm fine. Okay. I'm dressed for the occasion. <laughs> Hi, Karen. Nice to meet you. I never thought I'd see the day where my mom's getting a tattoo. Oh, really? It's my first this tattoo. Is like... You scared? Monumental. Uh, it's my daughter. Do I look scared? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Everyone knows I'm doing triple 20. I'm celebrating life. Do you have numbing cream? Yeah, we do have some. If you, you if might want to. Oh, yeah. yeah if you need oh. Some. It's Mother's Day weekend. I wanted a small G for my mother, which is her name is Georgia, to commemorate her life. If your 25 year old daughter wants to get a matching tat with you, it sort of makes me cool. You know what I'm saying? Are you nervous? Uh. Actually, no. I mean, I do my little injections for beauty anyway, so it's not very different, right? True. No, it is. Oh. <laughs> no, well, maybe I should it's be for nervous. Sure. It's been going on in the world of great Life has been beautiful. New York is as busy as ever, as always. I've been into a lot of fashion and content creation, which has been really fun. I do fashion PR, which has been absolutely nuts. But I love it. I never slow down. One day I'll slow down. Well, right I'll, be, I'll be around 85. Yeah, hallelujah, that's that's my girl. <laughs> Chip off the old block. Go ahead, baby. Yes, ma'am. Mm. Mom, I'm hearing rumblings of, uh, of a breakfast that I'm attending. I volunteered <laughs> you to share your experience with Grace about going to college. So I thought it would be nice if you, Giselle, Grace and I get together for breakfast. Texas, you and I talked about getting together with the girls. Yes. I would love okay. to have lunch or dinner. Yeah. Um, Raven will be down. OK. Love. OK. Can't um, wait. I know you've had moments where you had issues with Giselle, OK? I've had many. Right now, we're in a good place. So let's take advantage of the good place and do a good thing. You know, Grace is going to college, and I wanted Grace to talk to Raven. And Giselle wants, you know, Raven to share her experiences with Grace. And I love it. I think it's tattoo time. Are you, you really want to go first? I, I'm, let me meet the young man. Um, Ray, Karen, yes. nice, to nice to meet you. The good thing is you share my husband's name. Ray has no interest in tatting shit. And nor do I want to follow in the footsteps of Robin and Juan. Oh, <laughs> happily ever after. <laughs> See how that's going? You can go ahead and have a seat. Let's do it. OK. Oh, is that the G, Raven? This is our little G. So both want this one? Yes. Yeah. You like that? I like it. And you ready? I got to spin her around. Deep breath. Lord, oh, Lord. <laughs> Oh my God, this feels like giving birth. I'm doing good, Ray, right? Yeah, you are. <laughs> right? This took me longer than it should have. <laughs> Am I done? Yeah. Ray, you're an angel. Oh my God, it's still stinging Mom, though. Is, is, that, is that normal? Yeah, it's supposed to sting. What? He broke the skin. He broke the skin. Mom. It's so cute. I think that mommy is smiling from heaven right now. I do too. Raven, you ready? Sure. Are we ready, Raven? I love the little G. It's so quiet, you know, for because my mother was a small woman in statue, you know? It's so her. And then to do it with my daughter, it says I'm a little cool. It's cool it's that you thought I would do it. I did not think she would do it. It's done? Yeah. Go ahead and take a look. Get up? Yep. I'm see. sorry, who are you? Raven. Oh, oh that's so really cute. cute. Good to see you. Please oh, have a seat. OK. Thanks, please. So Elizabeth is the chief commercial officer okay. at Parfums de Marley. Okay. And she's making all of our dreams come true. Yes. I'm so proud of you. So the inspiration is oh, here. Yeah, what a good inspiration. Moms. This is, yes, it's the my chief name. mom. The chief mom. Yes. I love this. I love this. In our group, we all pretty much have special relationships with our moms. and. I recognize how many of us have been influenced and celebrated by our moms. So it's fitting that, you know, we have an event to celebrate the moms in our group and the mothers of the group. And then timing starts at two. Great. And then we have a violinist coming. Oh, 
Oh, that'd be beautiful. And then we have a fragrance bar. Oh my God. There's a lot of beautiful experiences. Okay. And you're gonna love the space. Okay. It's stunning. It kind of reminds me of my wedding. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. This is a f***ing wedding. I designed all that. I'm super. <laughs> oh my God. That's amazing. So today I'm going to show you. We have beautiful um, <gasps> invitations oh, and talk I about. Seen them. She wants to be surprised, but I wanted yes. you to kind of get it. They came from Paris, I love and that. I wanted you to make sure you knew that everyone was here and if okay, anything, great, great, great. anyone's yes. missing. So a hand delivered invitations. Um, Wendy for sure. Mia and Mia's mom. Okay. Charisse and Skylar. Okay. Um, Neca's mom is in Wisconsin, so she's going to bring her big sister, Karen. Yes. And Ashley. And her mom. Miss Sheila. Sheila. What have I always said about Ashley? She is a raggedy bitch, but she's a good mom. And I love her mom. And if Miss Sheila's coming with her wig, then she has to bring her child. And what about Giselle and her daughters? I have zero interest in having someone who would wish such ill on me and my family. Okay. She can stay home. I wanted to invite Robin, but I haven't talked to her. So are so, you going to try again to reach out or uh, some type of way you all talk? Um, I have to think about it. So I'll let you know. OK.